Well, there's at least one man who doesn't need the Habitat show to help him design homes. He's A. Hayes Town. As Marie Handy reports tonight, the local architect was honored this weekend by Baton Rouge citizens, honored for his outstanding work in designing several treasured old homes around the city. The conclusion of a four-day tribute to A. Hayes Town took place this afternoon on Pikes Lane. Several residents whose homes were designed by the renowned architect honored him by opening their doors to viewers. I had the pleasure of being one of them. The host home was designed for Dr. and Mrs. Robert D. Benedetto. We had 600 people who had pre-signed, and it was, that's not the drop-in. <laughs> A. Hayes Town arrived just before I moved on to the next home. Was this the first one on the block that you built or designed? Uh, it's one of the first. I, I don't remember what it was the first or not. But these people were very young when I designed it for them. I was delighted to find that the next home belonged to A. Hayes Town Jr., whom I met on the front lawn with two more generations of A. Hayes Towns. We chose the home that we wanted to copy off of, and he helped us with the designed to make it look like the Acadian house in St. Martinville. Dr. and Mrs. Charles Greeson's home was inspired by a 19th century home in New Orleans and the 18th century James Pito home. And when it was time to pick an architect, we discovered that everything that we had picked out had been done by Mr. Town. And so there was no decision to be made. We had already made our decision. Mr. Town has designed a large addition that is presently under construction in the rear of the house. Everything that you see that's old has been looked at before by Mr. Town before it's actually used. Let's take a peek back here and see if there's something. This is Marie Handy, Eyewitness News Night Desk. 